Perfect. Designing can be intimidating or frustrating, especially if you spend a lot of time on social media. Either you're overwhelmed by other people's level of design or discouraged that your ideas aren't as good as others. But that's understandable, but not fair to you. We all have a personal perspective and responsibility as designers. So I'm here to empower you to create designs for your brand with full confidence. Let's start with brand identity. What is your brand message or theme? It could be complex or as simple as your love for food. It just has to be something you're passionate about. If you could talk about the subject confidently and passionately, you can design just as strong. For example, my brand is about showcasing a process of mental health and I design based off that. Color palettes and silhouettes help communicate the brand identity through your designs. So choose colors that fit your theme. If I have a project that calls for a more sad or emotional tone, I will lean towards cooler colors and exaggerated silhouettes. This rule or any rule in fashion shouldn't be used as law so feel free to simply do your thing just try your best to express the ethos of your brand another way to emphasize your brand identity through designs is through motifs which is a distinctive feature or dominant idea in a artistic or literal composition for example my phase one capsule for my brand rituals emphasize the process of dealing with defeat which is a super personal experience and perspective for this capsule i chose to use cooler tones but for the sake of the fashion calendar i wanted to design some warmer options for the spring summer looks orange typically wouldn't match with this emotion i'm portraying but what will make it cohesive is the footprint motif i designed symbolizing being walked over and taken advantage of at the same time showcases the beauty of the initial bad experience i know you're probably wondering how do i create my own motif okay you found your brand identity now how does that look we need to conceptualize this idea maybe it's a phrase a texture or an object merge or contrast these different aspects and see what you come up with now you can use these newfound concepts themes and motifs as a foundation or a filter to your designs and marketing you can approach any project with this newfound point of view whether it's furniture or basic tea your designs will be authentic consistent and strong now it's time for you to unwind reset and learn more about your brand create safely like and subscribe for more designing tips